when i was called to be a deacon i went through this process and my spiritual gift is to serve uh yes i learned about spiritual gifts about 10 years ago when i uh first joined this church i've been hearing about spiritual gifts most of my life but not as in depth as what we did today well the workshop uh would have benefited me uh probably most of all to confirm uh the spiritual gifts or what i perceive as being my gifts um i felt that or out from taking it that i would have a better understanding of just why i'm here and why god placed me here on this earth before when i learned about my spiritual gifts they were different than they were this time i've changed i've grown spiritually as well as you know biologically so things in my life has changed i'm in a totally different season so what i have to offer or what i what god has shown me is entirely different at this point the workshop just confirmed the spiritual gift i had already known that i had and that was evangelism you have the talent and you just have to perform based on that talent and then you will i think that god will show you that he will empower you to continue to do that and that's when it turns into a gift that you can use to serve others in a particular ministry before i never felt i was the evangelizer <laughs> you know but that was what my gifts were in one of the explanations on one of the papers it said you must listen to people when you evangelize because everybody's i the of god is not the same as other people and you must be aware of this so when i heard that i would become a deacon i was excited because this was something i wanted i wanted to share and to serve because i know serving others is a gift from god i've gained new ones so it's like a like a race you know like i've inched a little bit forward on certain in certain areas i don't know you can have more than one spiritual gifts i always work with the uh, soup kitchen in the pantry so that meant i was always servicing people when somebody's having crisis i always felt like i could comfort them you know because that's the way my heart is i go to visit the sick in the hospitals I go to the nursing homes and um it gives me an inspiration how to serve and I'm a very compassionate person. I need a lot of encouragement so that I can perform and do more. I am proud to be where I am in First Church. There's a variety of gifts but how do we put it all together for it to work like a finely tuned machine for getting things done to the glory of God everyone should take the workshop when they're able to because this will give them a better understanding of just what reason and why are they here and how they can spread God's word or the understanding of God them for themselves and just what it is that they would be able to do to help others and to help others in the congregation and help others in their family and neighborhood but knowing just what it is that their gift is or what they're capable or the number one thing that they can do for others as long as you love what you're doing you bring out the best of you and serving people and serving my god is the best thing i can do